Good morning, everyone. Uh, today is going to be a great day. Um, I was traveling a lot last week. Um, had to make a trip to Georgia to help my son and my daughter-in-law. Um, so I decided on the way back, I would stop at my mother's house in uh, Cherry Log, which is close to Blue Ridge, Georgia. And I would stay at her house, um, get a little bit of quiet time. And then I decided today, which is Saturday, I would go to Amicalola Falls and I would walk up the stairs, get a bit of a workout in, and then maybe walk the side trail back down. Um, really excited about it. A little nervous, see if I can make these stairs or not, um, if I can do it um, without a pack then I can just continue to train with a pack. So I'm extremely lucky to be so close. We're only about 30 minutes away. And actually I was thinking this morning as I was getting ready to go, that this would be a fantastic place for any potential through hikers um, to stay. This area has a lot of rentals available and they have hotels in um, Elijay, uh, Blue Ridge. So this would be a great place for those who don't wanna stay at the lodge or have family traveling with them um, to watch them start. And then that way, you know, you can rest uh, in a comfortable location. like they are rebuilding the visitor center. Holy cow. Um, so I'm gonna go up here. It looks like they've got a trailer set up for the visitor center or something and pay my fee to get in here. And then I'll see if I can walk over to the arch. So here we are at the back of the construction, um, and there's, I don't know if you can see it, the arch is right there. So we're going to start walking up this trail here. So it looks like they say that the construction of the visitor center, the new visitor center, is going to be done in the spring of 2023 which is exciting i'm ready for the new bunch of hikers coming through 2023 all right hello so big day today i uh, walked up the stairs at the falls very exciting it was all about doing something that i've never done before and conquering my fears there was some parts i have a fear of heights um but there were some parts that were scary but i made it through so proud of myself and um 
so happy that I came up here today. So I'm gonna take the East, I think it's called the East End Trail back to the visitor center and that will be it for today and thanks for coming along it was an exciting day today hi everyone we are back home now and um, just wanted to mention one thing about today was that the walking up the falls wasn't as bad as I thought it would be we've been there a couple times and each time I have opted to drive up to the top um, because I was thinking that it would be super hard. And I don't know if it's because of all the training that I've done or if it's not as bad as I thought it would be. You kind of take it slow, which I did, and I did stop and rest along the way. There's not, I mean, there's only really one really great place um, to take photos and um, along the way the rest of it is very wooded but that spot had a lot of people in it so I really didn't even stop there so you just kind of climb to the top and once you get to the top it's really beautiful and I'll insert the picture of me at the top um, here but um, so then I walked up the lodge and I'll insert pictures of that here um, yeah, you all have probably already seen all of that from other people's videos and everything, but it never gets old for me. The, the view is just stunning. And then I walked down and decided to take, it's actually called the East Ridge Trail down. The first part of the trail, watch your step. There's a lot of uh, erosion and rocks and roots and and everything and the trail is very tight up at the top and then as you get down toward the bottom it is um, wider and much easier it takes you right down to the arch and got in my car and came home so I was super excited today anyway thanks for joining me hope you have a great day bye